Kids fam, welcome to my channel. My name is Mia and this is Mirror Kids and today I'm gonna give you all of the different steps of the things that I do when I want to start designing a new landing page for my clients. I'm gonna give you all, all the insider tips and in how I actually managed to do something that results in my clients loving the landing page that I'm doing for them. Let's go. Okay, guys, we're back on my bed because I'm screen recording. So regarding of creating the perfect landing page for your clients, I'm going to share, I guess, five or four steps of how you guys can achieve that and what is the right flow for me, at least, of doing this. So the first thing that I would love to do when I start a new project is like just creating mood boards of like different designs and like all of different styles that are out there and like are similar to what my clients client likes and just send it over to them for them to like decide like what exactly they want so after sending that over like an inspo board a mood board you may say and like they obviously will choose a couple of designs that they like you're gonna take that put that aside as the main style of the different explorations that you're gonna do the second thing that you want to do is you want to gather all of the different landing pages of people in the same business so for example if this is a developer platform you want to go around and find all these different developer platforms similar to this one and how they manage their landing pages okay after you did that and you just gathered all of those got familiar with the styles got familiar with the vibe and like how do they do it you want to go out and create a small wireframe we do this only for landing pages because that's more efficient to get the content and the copy from them so you just take around the different sections that you're gonna have in that landing page and get the copy from the client so you can actually design based off that copy always get the copy of the landing page because that's how you know what to put in there don't work with just what that section is get the copy and do it the right way okay and after you do that you want to go to like chrome whatever you use and just search best landing page uix design 2023 so by this you can actually find what are trendy what are the things that are trendy right now what are the landing pages that are doing good and you can learn from them and actually get some of the similar platforms that for example developers use or stuff like that for the similar community and get those platforms as well and add them to your audit so you want to do that and then you obviously want to go to the medium app and just search landing page designs and just read some articles just to stay on top of what's happening right now in the community and what's working these are the things you're going to do to stay like updated and after you did that you want to come back here and like start exploring based on like the vibe that is going on right now and the style that your client chose so i did a bunch of like different explorations here i used spline for all of these treaties here i found this one in figma community and you see i didn't put a lot of times into creating this i just gathered around different kinds of tree stuff that we could use and also used noise and texture plugin gonna link it in the description to create this type of background and then these are some of my previous like i had this from a previous work so i just wanted to add it here i created one here with like these lines of like networks and stuff like that and then after this based on the client feedback i went ahead and did another explorations of designs and uh, more developery you may say and try to like be creative like i added this type of selection i added this type of frame of code which i thought was pretty cool and like useful for this platform but none of this got accepted and there's nothing to be sad about it's just the process of designing a landing page a landing page is what actually represents a brand so you want to make sure to tag along with them and create the best thing for them and like don't end it up with one exploration so i did all this for them and then we went to another phase of exploration to like add what they like based on the comments and this is the other four explorations they're pretty similar showing that we're going to the right way and then the final two explorations that one i added the full landing page of them and how would they like look and what would the style be this is like the whole flow of designing a landing page you might shoot at the first time like they might like the first thing that you do and if they didn't just make sure that you continue and like you don't get discouraged this is how it actually works and also if you didn't want to design something from scratch you can always go to figma community and like find stuff that like works the best for you just remix them and well use them to your liking 
and you could also use a landing page builder file from figma which is like from sas design and it's like really cool template that you could use and yeah there are a lot of these things that you can do if you don't want to start something from scratch there's no shame in that well you maybe you don't have time to do all this stuff i'm gonna link all this in the description and i hope you enjoyed this one and that's it for this video make sure you give a thumbs up leave a comment follow my instagram for the daily ui challenge that i'm going through join me and if you don't know what it is about watch the video i posted monday i guess and yeah that's it why do i say that's it so much let's just get over with it i'm gonna see you in the next video make sure you subscribe bye